So good afternoon, everyone. I hope you're well. My name is Glenn Lambert. I'm the Head of School for Construction Science and Engineering at Canal. Within engineering at Canal, we offer a vast range of courses which start at level one, level two, and in some cases, level three. Alongside this, we also offer a wide range of apprenticeships. Some examples of that are currently our level two rail track apprenticeship. We offer a building services and property maintenance, apprenticeship at level two. We also offer level three rail engineering, a general engineering uh, apprenticeship, and again, a level three property maintenance. Alongside this, I'm very proud that we offer level four engineering apprenticeships also. Next slide, please. So within these apprenticeships, we've, we work very closely uh, with a vast range of employers. We work directly with Hitachi, Bombardier, Siemens, and essentially our courses are led by those employers and our partners. They're designed in conjunction with them. Now, what that means to any student that comes on to one of our courses, whether that be a traditional study program, so a full-time course without employment or an apprenticeship, um, or starting with us on an apprenticeship, what that means is your employment prospects are very, very high. Our facilities, if we can move to the next, next side, slide, please. <clears throat> Our facilities, both at Enfield and at Tottenham, are advanced and they are based on the, in, the current industry needs and that of the future. As you can see there in one of the pictures, we have what is known as a bogey. It's the bottom part of a rail carriage and you can see a number of our engineering students there working on the maintenance activities. To the right, you can see the more traditional lathes and mill, milling machines where the students undertaking our engineering courses are producing and manufacturing a wide range of uh, equipment, essentially, that some of which goes into that OB. Next slide, please. As you can imagine, with our high quality facilities, our high quality and advanced training that we provide and our links with employers, we're very proud that a lot of our students go on to win a, a number of higher awards within their companies. There's three students there, all of which that have won Apprentice of the Year, Most Improved Student. And on the right, we also have a couple of our staff there who uh, accepted the National Award for our Rail Academy over at our Enfield campus. Essentially, we can move to the next slide. Essentially, what we're doing within our engineering department, both at Tottenham and Enfield, is we prepare you for the future, not just the jobs of now. Now, I will talk briefly, because I know I skirted over it, just briefly about the types of programmes that we run. So at level one, when you enrol onto a level one course, that course is designed to help you develop the skills required to undertake mechanical engineering, electrical engineering, or the such. Now within that, that level one, we also offer our you, you will also undertake English and maths and you will be placed in a work placement, a real life work placement within one of the rail academies or one of our engineering partners. Now that level one's really good because what that does is it allows you to really identify what you're good at within engineering and the pathway that you really want to undertake. So engineering and the trades within it are very, very broad. Um, there's lots of different pathways that you can access. So when you start on our level one basic engineering skills qualification, you might want to go into manufacturing. You might want to go into maintenance. You may even want to go into motorsport uh, as an example. And then we can work with our employers and tailor the program that really meets your needs. Likewise, with level two, um, essentially, you'll have a number of mandatory units that you'll need to complete. And then there's optional units after that that really are designed based on the industry. So we may decide as a college, we may work with an employer that will say, I actually want them to do mechatronics. I actually want them to do some manufacturing units, et cetera, et cetera. And we'll build that into your program. Now, very high numbers of our students progress into employment. I think it's around 85%, 90% of the students go into employment or apprenticeships. And a lot of our apprentices progress very well within the industry. Um, and they earn lots of money essentially that's what you all want to hear really if you come to canal and you work hard and you get your head down and you get qualified you can earn in excess of 100k at the age of around 
26 by the time you're 26 if you're in study and you go on to a higher level apprenticeship some of our apprenticeships within rail start at around 24k a year um, and it just goes up it is an incredible incredible area to work in so i'm now open to any questions i'm sure there will be some i can't see any Thank you, Glenn. No, we haven't got any questions that have come through for you. Um, I just want to echo what you've just been saying then about how excellent. Um, sorry. I've got CNN on in the background because Joe Biden has just been elected president. They've just oh. announced it. Um, but yeah, no, it's the excellent work that, the, that your area does in terms of the engineering and the, and the great routes into work for, for people. So yeah, well done for the, for oh, the work that you're doing. Yeah, I think it I think it's also worth mentioning that um, myself, I sit on a number of initiatives to also improve opportunities for individuals into engineering. So if you look at our website, you'll see that I'm currently one of the Hamilton commissioners that is looking at um, improving BAME within the motorsport industry. I'm working directly alongside Lewis Hamilton and 12 other commissioners to improve those life chances. I'm also working on another commission with the Royal Academy of Engineering to help shape the qualifications of the future. So when you come to Canal and you undertake an engineering course with us, you can be sure we're not only preparing you for the skills today, but for the skills of tomorrow, next year and onward. Thank you for your time.